Hello friends, this is teacher JB. Let us study grammar in pieces. Grammar in pieces. Today we are studying possessive nouns. Use possessive nouns. Possessive nouns to show the possession by people. The possession by people. Use apostrophe and S at the end of the noun to show possession. For example, John has a car. So it is John's car. John apostrophe S. It shows the car belongs to John. John's possession. And then possessive adjective. It is his car. My boss has a house. And my boss is a woman. It is my boss's house. It is her house. Now boss is ending with an S. In this case, you can just put apostrophe or if you want you can put apostrophe s but either way is okay my boss has a house it is my boss house it is her house my parents have a cat it is my parents cat okay when in, in case it is a plural word and then ending s you can put apostrophe s only it is my parents cat it is their cat. So my parents plural. It is their cat. James has a dog. It is James dog. It is his dog. Now James is ending with an S. In this case you can just put apostrophe or you can put apostrophe S. Either one is okay. And Ty and Bai have a dog. So Ty and Bai their sisters. And they have one dog. So same ownership. In this case, we use buy's dog. Tai, no apostrophe S. But for buy, yes, we put apostrophe S. So it is Tai and buy's dog. And it is their dog. Sam has his dog. So he's Sam. And Jin has her dog. And Jin, Sam and Jin have dogs. They are Sam's dog and Jin's dog. So they are Sam's and Jin's dogs. So when uh, this ownership is different, we use apostrophe S for both. Sam and Jin have dogs. They are Sam's and Jin's dogs. So one more time, James has a dog. It is James' dog. It is his dog. Ty and Bai have a dog. It is Ty and Bai's dog. It is their dog. Sam and Jin have dogs. They are Sam's and Jin's dogs. James has a car. It is James' car. It is his car. So we understand this possessive adjective. And now let's think about this possessive noun ending with an S. When the name is ending with an S, we can put apostrophe only or apostrophe s. Either one is okay. But if you just like started using this one, you have to continue. Uh, you have to keep using the same form. You cannot use this one and then this one in the same writing. So if you uh, choose to use this form, you have to keep using this form. If you choose to use this form, you have to keep using it. It is something we must be careful. And Cindy has a cat. It is Cindy's cat. It is her cat. Tim and Sam have a ball. It is Tim and Sam's ball. It's the same ownership. Tom and Ben have balls. They are Tom's and Ben's balls. So different ownership. There are two balls. One belongs to Tom. One belongs to Ben. So you can say Tom's and Ben's balls. Claire's parents have a house. Claire's parents have a house. It is Claire's parents' house. So this one, it looks a little bit awkward, but you need to put Claire's and Claire's parents' house together. Okay, friends, this is the conclusion of today's study. I will come back to you with another piece as soon as possible. Until then, keep studying English and have a great day. Bye.